okay. Let's just, let's just calm down and realize that not everything is gonna go to plan. Oh god. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. It sucks. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. Or what? You'll actually shoot him? Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. Obviously, I'm not counting on you. That's why I have a gun. And I might even save you someday. About time. I am so <laughs> going to hit you. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm True looking story. forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just pay Frank his money, and then we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Yeah. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Okay, let's play this cool. Lead with, I've got your money, but we need information. And if there's extra money, give him the extra money and he'll give you the information. That's a really good way of doing it. We have a good hand here. I don't think Frank listened to my cleaning advice. <laughs> it's not funny anyway. Agreed. Frank. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? Give the money. Oh, I thank you. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And let's not do any more business again. Now, if you excuse me. Wait. Frank, could we ask you a couple quick questions? You have some serious lady balls. No. Ugh. Jesus, okay. Okay. <laughs> Yay. But I'm not getting you high. No, that's fine. Frank. We're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Uh, um... Listen, Frank. I'm sorry to be such a nuisance, but... This is important. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. But I can tell you're not bullshitting me. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, well, it always starts with just a little. And Chloe here knows all about that, don't you? Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. I didn't pull the trigger. I am so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. I definitely I, couldn't. I try not to. And I never would have pulled the trigger. So glad I, I didn't. Just... Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay, we're cool for now. But my dog isn't. And if you try any shit, 
He will bite your head off. He's done it before. We're only here to talk. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? I love them. I love dogs. I love dogs. Period. I wish I had one trained as well as yours. Yeah, he had a bad trainer before. Real bad. But he's dead now. And okay. I trained Pompadou how to be my friend. That's very cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we I think can I'm focus playing on this well. Rachel now. Rachel? Sorry. Is that why you're really here? Yes. We're so yeah. close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now. Especially from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? Please, Frank, come on! Rachel's photo. Just let her. Rachel said she gave you one of her favorite photos. That proves how much she cares. And you care. That's why you have to help. How the hell did you know about that photo? That's my favorite picture of her. He showed I it, can look at it any time and she'll always be there for me. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. We can change all that. We can it's I can help you, you, I promise. Help us find her, Frank. <clears throat> Please. Come on. We really need your client Come list. Come on, Frank. Well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. I'll take it. Yes! My dog isn't barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. Thank you, Frank. Oh god, that went well. That went really well. And we got the gun back. Thank you. Yeah, thanks, Frank. Seriously. It's hard to take you characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. That went really, really well. <laughs> like, I'm really surprised. That was cool Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. Yeah. You know, he was actually really nice. I guess when it's not about money or drugs, he's actually kind of cool. Let's go. Oh, I forgot to see if I could take any pictures. Oh well. Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. Hmm. I better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. Oh. Oh god. Oh! Hi Max, just thought I'd wish you and Chloe good luck for your search. With what little luck I have left. Thanks, Frank. The bigger our team, the more luck we'll have. I see why Chloe digs you. Stop by later if you both want to party. And good luck. My god, I love this game. I'm so glad that we're getting friends with everybody. Ugh. Oh, I feel so much better. Okay. Frank's clues. Okay. Um. What? Oh, Let's look oh at gosh. Frank's drug deals okay. during the week of the party. Okay. Wait. I want to look at it. Hmm. Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. Oh, right. Okay. Um, so we need that piece of paper, right? Look. look Rot one. must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Rotten. Okay. Wait. Chihuahua Katie? Hmm. 
A bulldog, Chloe. Rot Nathan. Huh. Okay. So, I think it's that. And then... Nope. That. Yes! The game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. Okay. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Frank made with Nathan. So Nathan was rot. So, look. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. Rottweiler. He could open rot. a store. There. Three grams of whatever that is. Okay. Um, select. Um, look. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. That explains a lot. Stray dog, I guess that's just like a one-time deal. Not a regular customer. Okay. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? Okay, no rot. I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Probably like puppy or something. There's one, two grams of cocaine, $150? Like, I don't know how much a lot of cocaine is, but two grams doesn't sound like a lot at all. And there's some more here. So, that one, select. And then this one. I'm getting a contact high just reading this. Nope. And look. Hmm. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. Yep. $900. $250. Huh. That one? Select. Oh, yes. These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Uh, that's it, Max. Okay. Now we go over here and look at David's clues. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? I think it's the latter. I think he's just very paranoid and very protective. <sighs> Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. Hmm. Twilligerson? At least David was finally going after the right suspect. I'm not entirely sure what I'm supposed to do here. Of course, I'm a suspect. <laughs> Proving David sucks as a detective. Sorry. <laughs> I guess Twilligetson is... Okay. I hope in this case that David has good tracking skills. Select. Select. Select and that's all she wrote. Please okay, let me find some clues about Nathan in here. Okay, so David's clues investigate. Great, now how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Okay, um, I'm glad Warren got his revenge. Me too. There's Nathan dealing to the kids right out in the open. Isn't that the guy who bugged out last episode or two episodes ago? It's just like a general general character model. Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating, as usual. Okay, so his is the red SUV, and this one looks like it'll give us a good shot. Interesting. Is this Nathan's car? Okay, Twilgutson. Okay, so select, 
And find yep, Twelgan. Another car David was tracking. Twin Peaks. That's um That's Chloe's car. Hmm. Who else was David tracking here? Hmm. That's definitely Chloe's car. Twin Peaks, that's Chloe's. Wow, sir. This looks like an expensive machine. I think this is the one that, um, you know, last episode at the very end, whether we were looking at, like, you know, the ending? I think this one is, um, Mr. Jefferson's car. I think that's whose car this is, Mr. Jefferson. And so he's been tracking Mr. Jefferson as well. Hmm, well he did say that he didn't trust him. Nope, not that one. I wonder who that was. Why the hell are you following these people? And to where? That one. Oh. Uh, and... This one. Okay, this is just sad, Max. Okay, not that one. This one? Come on. To do Nathan's license plate number, then match it up with the coordinates. I have deduced his license plate number. Huh. Okay. He's got this red car here. Which is... Okay, definitely this one. So look at this. Hmm. Who does oh. this car belong to? Oh, it's a different car. Okay, so it's this one. Those two look identical. The only difference is the busted light. So look at this. That has a busted light. Okay, so... So... Select. Uh, select. And then S, I think is... Oh my god, it's so hard to pick this one. Yeah. Okay. Select. Oh yes. Yes. Now we're finally getting somewhere. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. Okay. Finally, Max, I Nathan's know we clues. can snap all these pieces together. I'm sure Roger we can. That. I'm gonna study the. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? Holy shit! Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Nine nine three six. Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Okay, select. Select. Uh oh, select. And <sighs> there's a lot of numbers in here. Well, this is his real one. Oh no, that's his fake one, okay. Uh, select. Okay, Max. Let's blow this code up and go home. Okay. Get ready to fucking die, bitches. Bishes. What? I thought he was remorseful. He's not even slightly remorseful. I trust people too much. Okay, <clears throat> here we go. Let's start hacking. Um, okay, it's probably on this piece of paper. Although, no, a lot of people use their birthdays. So, 29, 95. Or August 29th? Um, August was the January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. The 8th month? So... Oh, but it's backwards, isn't it? So 2908. The 29th of the 8th? No, that's ours. The 8th. 0829. Let's try that. 
O eight two nine. Score. Oh. Now let's check First out all go. the messages from the week Kate was dropped. Um. Yes. Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. Sweet. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Drug mm. dealer drama. God, Nathan. You're out of control. So it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Hmm. Here we go. Um, okay. Take a breath, Max. Go through all this data, and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay. So, first of all, we need to find the date of the party. And that we can do by looking at the text, right? So. <sighs> Let's start with this one. Okay, 10 7. Okay, that looks good. 10 7. So he needs more. 10 7. No, not 10 4. Okay, so it was the 10th of the 4th. Uh, no, the, the 4th of the 10th. <laughs> okay, so look at this. No, not that one. 10-4. Ten, 10-7. Ten, ten, hmm. That one. Yeah. Wait, oh, this says the night of the so, party. This infamous party. Oh. Was the <laughs> okay, so this was this was the big one for the fourth. Yeah. So Okay, select one and then no doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room so he could be hiding clues there too no not much out there though that was late on the 10th floor that one looks like this isn't the right combination Oh my god, I'm so bad at this. Okay. Fuck. Are there any more? That one. That one, that one, that one. Okay. If I can match one of the text messages and transactions with Frank, then I can find the exact location. Okay, okay, okay. Um, okay, look. 1024... Okay. Right, that's too early. That's the one. That's the one. That's the one on the boondocks. Select. Oh! Chloe. I found it! This is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here.
Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Just a shitty old barn. That could Let's be keep it. Searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. Prescott. I'm shocked. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. True story. Do you hear, Chloe? Yes, sir. 